Hello again and welcome to part 4. In this um, video what we're going to be doing is writing our firewall rules to allow IPsec, um, L2TP, NAT traversal and also PPTP to come through our firewall um, but pretty much nothing else. Okay let's jump into configuration mode. Uh, now, dum -dum 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 -dum, let's do set firewall and we're going to do name, call it outside. We want a default action of drop. And let's start. So, rule 10 action accept, destination. and I'm missing out something is except destination it's going to is that and it helps if I specify that that's a port protocol is UDP and source address is anywhere next one we're gonna have this is rule 15 action accept and its protocol is GRE rule 16 action is accept destination and that's a port protocol is TCP this one is going to be rule 20 action accept this is not traversal rule by the way protocol is UDP source address is that okay next one rule 25 action accept destination Port is 500. Protocol is UDP. And we need another one, which is going to be rule 30. Action accept. And then we do IP set because it's a special rule and it matches IPsec and then we need a final rule which is going to be rule 40 which says action accept state established enable okay let's see what we missed nothing that's a good start okay now if I jump into here best thing is to ping so 213-123-10-100 I believe it's currently responding decrementing because it's going through one router so at the moment we're pinging from here all the way through to here and it's being accepted okay so set interface ETH0 we set the firewall now we want the firewall in name allow established because we want packets that are already established to come in and local name we want that to be outside let's commit and see if it explodes let's see what happens here
Okay, those are currently going through. One thing that we can do is on the outside one, what we can do is if we do set interface, uh, no, set firewall, name outside, you'll see an option in here which should be if we set firewall and somewhere in here all ping disable what that should do is now pigging doesn't work okay let's save that So we've created all these fancy rules, but now actually have we managed to do it so that we can't actually dial in now? Okay, let's do this one. Remember this is L2TP. Cool, so L2TP goes in and connects. Let's check to see whether it can actually pass traffic to. Okay, now PPTP. And there we go, PPTP is now connected. And if we can just double check. Dot one, two, three, dot ten, dot one hundred. See, we can't ping that, yet we can ping. A Windows 2003 box which is sitting out here. So that's it really. We have our, a, um, our PPTP and our IPsec links. Um, you can use the connection information and the way that I've configured these to configure an iPad or an iPhone uh, and they both will connect to Viata and will work. The configuration that I've shown you which is here is the same configuration that works with an iPad and iPhone. Okay, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video uh, and I hope to see you again soon.